sports opinion log like Sanderson World, the top 1% to the people sportscaster. And in this video, it's going to be a follow-up on my Dak Prescott video pertaining to white slave master Jerry Jones, who is leaving Dak Prescott high and dry and will potentially insult him and slap him in the face with a franchise one-year deal worth $33 million. And I'm going to answer the fan mail or fan comment by a hater who clearly suffers from reading comprehension. You've entered the sports opinion log here on Lex Anderson World. I'm said person. And if you're down with all things NFL, AFC, NFC, make sure you're doing the right thing and liking this video, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell icon to stay notified for any and all upcoming future videos. And while you're doing that, drop a comment below and let me know where you stand on the insulting degrading, humiliating behavior of white slave master Jerry Jones as pertaining to Dak Prescott and his contract that is left hanging in the air like a football pass being thrown across the field. Let's go. I'm going to respond to a comment from a viewer. Shout out Stephen Nate Era. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Stephen Nate Era says to me, why do you always play the racial card? He paid Zeke and he's black. He paid Lawrence and he also and he's also black, Jalen Smith. Steven, you suffer from reading comprehension issues because this video pertains to the African American quarterback. So Steven, let me, the top one percenter, the people's sportscaster, the man who unlike over 40 to 50 fucking million people in America can't read, let me do the work for you and break down NFL contracts pertaining to NFL quarterbacks. So Steven, let me help you out. The NFL's highest paid quarterbacks Average salary per year, number one, Russell Wilson, $35 million. Number two, Big, Big Ben for the Steelers, 34. Number three, Aaron Rodgers, 33.5. Number three, oh, okay, they're in a tie for third place. Excuse me. Rams, Jared Goff, 33.5. Number five, Carson Wentz, Eagles, $32 million. Number six, Falcons, Matt Ryan, $30 million. Mind you. Also, fully loaded, $150 million guaranteed. Number seven, Kirk Cousins, $28 million. And in case you don't know, Stephen, fully guaranteed $84 million for Kirk Cousins. Number eight, Colts, Jacoby Brissett, $27.98 million. Number nine, 49ers, Jimmy G, Garoppolo, $27.5 million. And number 10, the Lions, Matthew Stafford at $27 million. And Matthew Stafford, Stephen, in case you do or don't know, has never won a motherfucking playoff game. So don't come at me on some race card when white slave master Jerry fucking Jones isn't poning up the money on Dak Prescott, who is earning $2.03 million motherfucking dollars, which means that Dak Prescott is practically fucking starving. Waiting for his payday, even though when he won his first playoff game against the Seahawks, Jerry Jones went out and bought a $150 million goddamn super yacht, which I placed in the other two videos in the previous video. So don't come telling me about what the fuck I do on my motherfucking channel. Sports Opinion Log. Lex Anderson world, the top one percenter, not only am I the people sportscaster, not only am I going to say what the nationwide sports leader, what the Foxies, what the corporate shells are afraid to say, it is race related. I do my fucking research because I can read intelligence. <laughs> it's going to tell me about why I talk about race because it is about race. What more does a black man have to do to get properly paid by his white slave master owner? Lex Anderson, signing out.